Hello, hello, and welcome back to another coin and review. So, um, I spent money again, and I got, uh, if anybody remembers, these. Well, I have already shown two, but I was missing two. That has been rectified. I got the last two. I'm guessing there will be more, but now I have the ones in existence. So here we have the double silver giant. Triceratops. Oh yeah, from 2022. And I'm not sure how well it picks up on the camera here, but it does look pretty sweet. If you don't get it from the right angle, it kind of just looks completely black, but at the right angle you can see what that is. And I do like the, um, the copper color here on the black. It looks really nice. Other than that, it doesn't really do much. Triceratops information on the back, which is nice to have, but we'll go over that in a moment. Let's take a look at the coin. That's why we're here. So here is the beauty. So um, let's take the stats first and we talk about details. So, um, yeah, country Vanuatu or something like that. Uh, is that a small island in the Pacific? Yeah, anyways. From 2022, and uh, the value of this is 10 Vatu. Fair enough. I have no idea what that might be, but then again, nobody buys these things to spend them in a local store, so who cares? Metal, and that's the interesting part. Buy metal. There are two metals in this thing. Silver and copper. Mostly copper, though. Um, so, specifically, it weighs 155 grams which should be roughly 5 ounces and 10 of those, well 10 grams of the total, silver and 145 is copper. So basically what is going on is the entire center here is copper and it has been coated here in some silver and also on the back. So yeah, pretty sweet deal. So the size of this thing, the diameter is 60 millimeters. So it's a pretty chunky boy. It is heavy, but then again, the capsule here does add some weight to that. I've never taken one of these out. Kind of. I don't recall which one it was, but one of the two, this one or the other one, actually came loose. Um, I didn't know how to get the bottom out, but actually it screws out. Like this. So, there we go. So, good to know, in case. I suppose. Well, anyways, um, what else? Um, it has been antiqued, which looks really nice. I do like that. So, uh, yeah. Uh, last thing, I suppose, is mintage. And it's an odd number, but 1,999. One shy of 2,000. So, that's cool. Anyways, let's get to the details. Um, the one of the T-Rex I did like. The... Um, oh, forget the other one that I reviewed. I didn't quite like as much. But I would say this one is up there with the T-Rex. I mean, the details here. You have the head with the horns. Maybe it looks a little bit like the horns are... Not kind of pointing in the right way, but then again... That is a difficult detail to get on there. I mean, it is kind of 3D, but... Eh, not that 3D. But you can see the legs, the mouth with its kind of beak there, some plants in the background, eyes. It looks very nice. And I'm not sure how well it's going to pick up here, but it is definitely high relief. That's for sure. The beak there, you can see through. It definitely sticks out. So this is a very nice piece of art, I would say. And yeah, if anybody likes buy metal, I would say definitely this should be in your collection. And if you also like dinosaurs, I'm not a big fan myself as such, but I couldn't help myself. It's just a beautiful coin. The copper color here is also extremely nice. I love that. And on the back, I'm pretty sure that's the same as the other two. We have the dinosaurs going around. Could be future dinosaurs to come out on these. Um, let's see. 
don't say no, no, no. I'm not sure if one is supposed to. Oh, well, was that the one? Or is that a similar one? I don't know. But that was one of the ones that I reviewed. I'm not sure about if there's a T Rex here. Looks more like a raptor. Could that be the T Rex? Well, if it is, um, maybe some of these will be there in the future. That would be pretty sweet. Spinosaurus, I think. Uh, that would be nice. Uh, I'm not sure exactly which one that is. Bronchosaurus or something. That would also be nice. And a raptor, of course, would be nice. So, yeah. And we have this coat of arms, I suppose. Um, can't quite make out what it says here in the middle. But it says something, and there's a I guess it's a native dude with a spear, some kind of headdress. And we have the text going around the tin Vatu. Also antique, looks very, very nice. And yeah, 2022 Triceratops. That's cool. So yeah, I hope you liked it. I certainly did. Thank you for watching. Until next time, bye bye.